In today's video, I'm opening up the 2017 Kyber Megatin. Coming up. What's up there and welcome to a brand new video on 414YGO. In today's video, I'm opening up the 2017 Kyber Megatin. And hey, if you're new here and you want to join the 414 community, hit the subscribe button and the notification bell so you don't miss out on any of my future videos. So this tin, I picked this up from chaoscards.co.uk. And you know what? A lot of people were kind of moaning that they were going for another Yugi and Kyber theme again for the Megatins, but being such like a fanboy of the old series, I love it. And I love the artwork on this. This looks absolutely uh, amazing. Look at that. So we've got Kyber uh, with the Kyber Corp logo behind him in his classic Battle City um, like setup there, which looks really cool. Um, so the side of the tin, we've got the Kyber Corp logo there at Yu-Gi-Oh. I imagine the same again on that side, Kyber Corp again uh, and Yu-Gi-Oh again. So on the back of the tin, so what we're gonna get is a three 2017 Megatin Mega Packs. Uh, so I believe it's got cards from like Shining Victories, uh, The Dark Illusion, Invasion, Vengeance, and Raging Tempest, which is amazing. Um, there's gonna be a secret rare Blue Eyes White Dragon in here. There's two ultra rare cards, one being Proxy Dragon, the other being Pot of Desires. There'll be an ultra rare token featuring Seto Kaiba himself. And two super rare cards, number 68, Sanofon the Sky Prison, and the Elder Entity Ntis. Ntis, I think that's how you pronounce it. So, um, what I'll do is I'll just get straight into this tin and we'll uh, see what goodies we get. Beautiful. Uh, I'm aware I'm a bit late to the game on this one. I think there's quite a few openings online already, but of course I just had my... Uh, Big 414 King of Games tournament, so that kind of set me back on all these openings. Uh, if you want to check out any of those character deck duels, they're on the channel, so uh, make sure you do that. But there we go, here's the tin out of the wrapper, it looks absolutely awesome. So get that off there. There she is, the blue eyes white dragon. So a big tin, uh, itty bitty packaging. <laughs> make sure there's nothing underneath. I always feel that they should include like something in, in like under here. It feels just like it's screaming for something, yeah? <laughs> but I don't know if that's just me. Okay, let's move that tin to the side. Obviously we've got the tin anyway, so it's gonna be a uh, cool storage. Over there you go, Sam. So obviously we can see the blue eyes white dragon there. Um, strange wrapping on this as well. Oh yeah, I've just cut my nails. I've got nothing to uh, open, there we go. <laughs> if all else fails, brute strength. <laughs> awesome, it's more wrapping. So here's all our variant cards here, and we've got the, uh, the three 2017 Megatons. I really need to sort my lighting out in life because uh, it's really shining here, but it's fine. So let's start with the cards. And so we've got a secret rare Blue Eyes White Dragon, and this is the artwork that came with uh, the first ever set of Yu-Gi-Oh! Legend of Blue Eyes. Uh, that thing looks absolutely incredible. That is really cool. Obviously that classic 3000 attack, 2000 defense. Happy with that, it's so good. Set them over there. And we've got a proxy dragon here. So it's a link monster. Uh, 1,400 attack. Uh, if a card or cards you control would be destroyed by battle or card effect, you can destroy one of your monsters. Uh, this card's this card points to instead. Cool. Could be could be handy in some way. Uh, then we've got pot of desires there. Looks really cool. A famous pot of greed. What does it do? What does it do? If only we knew. <laughs> Uh, okay, so we've got number 68, Sanofon the Sky Prison. That thing looks absolutely uh, amazing there. Boss, love the artwork on that. And we've got Elder Entity Ntis, and she looks cool. I love the artwork on her. Four Star Monster Fusion Monster, with a beast of a 2500 attack. Pretty cool effect as well. And then finally we've got the token, which is the same artwork as what we've got on the tin, and that thing looks incredible. Massive, massive fan of Kyber, so I'm a big fan of that token. That looks really sweet. Put that with the uh, the other collection of tokens that we get from the uh, the legendary decks. But that's awesome. So let's get into these mega packs and see what cards um, we're gifted with. Quite the package. No pun intended. Okay, so we have a digital bug web solder. 
We've got Redice Cycle. Uh, we have a Desk Bot Base. A Raid Raptor Pain Lanius. A Heavy Freight Train Derek Rain. Uh, Rio Okimi. Rio Okimi? That's cool. That's really good, actually. Sweetness. Uh, Illusion Magic. The Dark Magician. Uh, tribute one spellcaster type monster. Add up to two copies of Dark Magician from your deck and or graveyard to your hand. You can only activate one Illusion Magic per turn. I like that. That's cool. So that's our rare. Uh, super rare, we've got a Zodiac Whiptail. She looks pretty cool as well. So over there. Ultra rare, we have a Block Dragon. <laughs> sweet, sweet. Cool artwork on there. And secret rare, we have a Dimensional Barrier. Which looks really good. Uh, we've got Zodiac Combo. Uh, Meme. <laughs> Miscellaneousaurus. Awesomes. Uh, Predaplant Mirai Nepenthith, or Thess. Ancient Gear Hunting Hound. That's really good. Shout out to Crowler there, who did really well in the uh, the tournament. Performer Pal Han Standacoon. <laughs> good guy's face. <laughs> incredible, incredible scenes here. Illusion Magic. That's really cool. I'm happy with that. I was hoping for some more, like, kind of Dark Magician cards out in these packs. Being a fan of Dark Magician. Who isn't? <laughs> Let's see what we can get. Let's see what we can get. Second 2017 Mega Pack then. So we've got the Master with Eyes of Blue, which is really fitting for the Kyber Tin. Uh, Redicicle again. Finite cards. Uh, Forbidden Dark Contract with the Swamp King. Awesome. Uh, Dice Lops. That looks awesome as well, actually. Uh, we've got Magical Midbreaker Field. Uh, rare is DD Savant Thomas. Uh, super rare, we have a metamorph uh, <laughs> Metamorph. <laughs> I can't say that. <laughs> cool artwork, though. Uh, ultra rare, we've got uh, Shiranui Solitaire. Shiranui. Uh, I can't pronounce that. It's fine. But the guy looks awesome anyway. Some sort of uh, samurai mage going on there. It was really cool. And secret rare is a cosmic cyclone. Cool. Pay 1,000 life points, then target one spell or trap card on the field and banish it. Awesome source. Okay. The rest of the commons got a Sheena Bird Crow. We've got Double Cypher. Ignites Unite. <laughs> I like that cool name. Uh, Christron Rion. Another Mare Mare. And uh, Sheena Bird Salvation. Final 2017 Mega Tin Pack. For this one anyway, because I have the uh, the UV Tin as well, obviously. And uh, that will be up next week. And hopefully everything will resume as normal. Beacon of White, another Blue Eyes card for our Blue Eyes White Kyber <laughs> Tin. Mm -hmm. uh, I like that. Okay, uh, Dice, Dice Lops, uh, Blackwing Gofu, the Vague Shadow. It's very vague. Uh, Totem 5, that looks really cool. Uh, Master with Eyes of Blue, again. A Digital Bug Corbage, I think. Uh, Spirit of the Fall Wind, uh, as a rare, really cool. And we've got a Toon Dark Magician. That's awesome. I was saying that I wanted some Dark Magician stuff, and a Toon Dark Magician is, you know, cool. I'll take that. That's sweet. It's a super rare. Toon Dark Magician. And we've got an ultra rare white stone of ancients, which is fitting once again for our blue eyes theme here. Uh, secret rare is. Damn! Dark Magic Circle. Damn. That's awesome. <laughs> Sweet. I, I seem to remember this card being like quite a hard one to get. Correct me if I'm wrong, but like. Damn. I'm happy with that. <laughs> wow. So when this card is activated, look at the top three cards of your deck. Then you can reveal one Dark Magician or one Spell or Trap that specifically lists the card Dark Magician among them. And add it to your hand. Also place the remaining cards on top of your deck in any order. If Dark Magician is normal or special summoned to your field, except during the damage step, you can target one card your opponent controls and banish it. You can only use the effect of Dark, magic's, dark Magical Circle once per tap. 
That's awesome. I'm really happy I got that. There's a really cool Dark Magician and Orientated Pack, even though it was Toon Dark Magician, but hey, it's Toon Dark Magician, right? That's awesome. That is awesome. I'm really happy with that. Sweetness to the core. Final comments says, we've got Fairy Tale Rella. She looks awesome. Uh, Palezoic Morella. Uh, Canitor. Or Canine Tour, I think. <laughs> Chris Dunn entry, uh, Cypher Bit, and the final card is Sprite's Blessing, which is awesome. Put down there. I'm happy with that. You know, I, that Dark Magical Circle really made my day. <laughs> so, um, awesome source. Let me know what your thoughts on this uh, this tin are in the section below. I'll leave links down there. So, if you want to pick up uh, the, the Mega Tins yourself, then just head down there. Um, it will save you some time searching, though it probably won't take as long. <laughs> but if you want more Yu-Gi-Oh! openings, Yu-Gi-Oh! fact videos, character deck duels, profiles and more, hit the subscribe button right now. If you found value in today's video, smash the like button, share the video with a friend and of course, uh, leave me a comment in the section below. I'm hanging around on social media, uh, my phone's broken at the moment, but hey, if you want to follow me, follow me over there. And uh, that is it from me guys, I will see you in the next video. Take care.